I am on a mini break. We decided to have a little weekend away because my sister-in-law said that she would look after the baby and the dog. So we're having a sort of couple's break and it's amazing. We're very relaxed. We're at Limewood Hotel, which is incredible. I'm gonna show you around there. It's definitely one of the nicest hotels I've stayed at. It's like being in somebody's very posh country house. Um, but we're going on a forest ramble through the new forest. So uh, that's what's happening now. I'm sure I'll start missing the baby in approximately half an hour's time. But for now, we're just enjoying a little bit of, it's not me time. What do you call it when there's two of you. Our time. <laughs> what if it fights us? Right. How do you know? They're scared of us. Well, no, that's scared. Oh, it's be just my luck to get gored to death by some errant stag who's been trained by the FBI to Bye bye. Mr. I have an inbuilt compass has taken us off piste. And now we're sort of stumbling through Bracken. I'm worried about getting gored to death by an evil stag or possibly coming across a zombie who has been let out of some kind of testing facility. Because they're always out in woods and stuff, aren't they? I don't know where we're going, to be quite honest. If I don't make it back and someone discovers this camera, please upload to youtube.com stroke a model recommends. We've been walking for 17 days now and still no sign of the hotel. Why am I holding? A fan in front of my face. Oh. Welcome to my humble abode. I think this is called Coach House One. Oh, my legs are so wobbly after that walk. It's so nice in here. I'm not sure this is the room that I was supposed to have, actually. Um, log burner, a mini bar in there. There's a seating area and then there's an upstairs. Obviously, otherwise where would you sleep? It's so lovely and bright. Although, <laughs> there's a man that's got a pillow instead of a head. A really lovely bright bathroom. Two sinks. <gasps> Bamford toiletries. And surrounded by forest. And there's a bath and another sink behind there. And then out here, a lovely little surprise, a little terrace. It's quite the sun trap. Ordering our breakfast for tomorrow. Decided to be really lazy and quite literally not leave our room. So we're just about to find the twig, pen, and tick the things we want. I may as well just tick everything, really. Bought a new book in a bit of a rush. I had about two minutes to get it. Um, and I just went to the sort of bestsellers stand, really. I've read loads by Sebastian Falks before, so I'm hoping this one will be really good. I try not to look at my phone, so I'm thinking I'll get stuck into this if Mr. AMR turns the bloody footballer. Good morning, everyone. 
slept really really well so quiet and this bed is so comfy um and now just waiting for breakfast to arrive because i'm really hungry today i have got um a one and a half hour massage and then i've got a facial later on in the day really kindly organized by pi skincare um if you read my website you'll have heard me mention them loads over the years because they're just brilliant for sort of sensitive sensitized skin uh, that doesn't tolerate many products and I first discovered it when I was modeling loads and my face just used to get really sore if I was doing a beauty shoot and wearing lots of makeup so yeah they stock their products in the spa here and they also do treatments and so they've organized for me to have some which is just the most amazing treat so that's what I'm pretty much going to do for the whole day that and just do nothing we've had some nice photos through of angelica who's having a great time over at auntie emma's and um i am missing her but on the other hand it's really amazing just to be doing what i want to do <laughs> so yeah all good so far what's in there Yogurts, pastries, I think that's Mr. AMR's breakfast. And then we've got coffee and tea and juices and fruit. I thought I'd ordered more than this actually. I should have just ticked everything. I'm so greedy. I'm gonna go and steal some slippers from the bathroom because my feet are cold out there. shame it's raining there's a beautiful herb garden roof terrace up there and then now you can let's go and have a look at the pool hopefully there's nobody in there it's set over three floors and it's just beautiful there's a raw cafe and there's an outdoor pool there and an indoor pool in there and there's my tower. I'm gonna go and see my prince. We are driving through the new forest because it's raining and we're actually going to go to Lyndhurst, but we thought we'd scope out the pig, which was my other choice for coming away. Um, and I think it's the sister hotel to Limewood, actually. So that's what we're doing. It's not quite so grand. This is more like a sort of country house, I suppose. And it looks really nice. So yeah, that's the pig. It's cool inside. <sighs> Goodbye again. It is eight o'clock in the morning. I'm off to the Herb House Spa again because um, I want to take some pictures of the inside, which is amazing. But I wanted to do it while, oh, the paper's here, while it's um, quiet. So hopefully nobody else is crazy enough to have been awake since 6.30 on a Saturday. Um, Mr. AMR stayed up till three o'clock in the morning watching the Olympics, idiot. So he doesn't want to come. Um, basically I'm cutting it over with as well because look at my hair. My hair is saturated in oil but I have this thing after I've had treatments that I won't, I don't want to wash for the rest of the day because of all the oils that are on me and I kind of think it's just a waste to then go and wash them off. So um, it's getting to the point where I don't want to go to breakfast with myself looking like this and I don't want to have a wash if I'm then going to go back to 
um, am I talking about? I need an umbrella as well. Um, if I've then got to go back in the pool. Oh my god. I've got no rain. So yeah, that's where I'm going. It's pouring with rain. And um, let's go and see how busy the spa is. Look at that for a view, the hydrotherapy pool. Just looking out onto the forest is amazing. Oh my God, it's so hot in here that my eyes are actually burning. I think my eyelids are on fire. I'm literally in here to take a photo, but my camera's steaming up. I know it's supposed to be hot, everybody, but I'm stood here in a massive gown with a towel around me as well. Oh, I'm going indoor pool. And out there, funny enough, is the outdoor pool. But um, it is pouring down with rain. Yesterday, Mr. AMR went in there and said it was amazing to go in in the rain. But it's just hammering it down. No chance. There's that little turret up there. Oh yeah, I meant to show you in here yesterday. Um, but there was somebody in here. This is the relaxation room where you can go after your treatment. And something I thought was really good was that, I think I read this, they didn't say to me yesterday. You can plug in um, an iPod or whatever, iPhone, and uh, I think that you can get like both sound cancelling headphones so that it's really quiet. Also, you can tilt the bed up and down, which is amazing. And there's a reading light. So it's all really nice and gloomy in here. I nearly fell asleep yesterday and missed my treatment. Right, I've washed my hair and it's breakfast time. Bye lovely coach house room. See you soon. We're back together, reunited, aren't we? And, mmm, oh, that's nice and, oh, um, I know, it's soggy. Um, it honestly feels like we've never been away. Doesn't it? Hey? But I have to say, tweed. Um, that, oh, look at me looking all gargantuan in this shirt. Um, is it my hunched posture? I feel like, you know that bit in Men in Black, at, shut up, Men in Black at the beginning where the farmer turns into the alien who's like, oh, <laughs> I'm gonna, I've got to find, a, I've got to find a picture of him now to cut in. Ah, so yeah, that was a nice relaxing couple of days. It was really, really good. I'm glad that we did it. Although I did miss you a lot. I did? Yeah, anyway, thanks for watching this vlog. And um, I will be doing a blog post about my little trip, no doubt. So make sure you read that and I shall see you next time. Big bird out. <laughs>